I'm back at my new Hoopty Fleet headquarters where I've been hard at work making this place an inviting home for my automotive rejects. And as you can see, it's coming along. But first, a major announcement. My six month ownership report of the 1993 Lincoln Town Car is not a very exciting one. I've put only about 500 miles on my Jack Nicholas Golfer Edition car over the course of my ownership, and it's been a totally solid, reliable citizen. It's always started and never gave me any trouble, which is pretty impressive for a 25-year-old car with over 200,000 miles. But I barely drive it. So I've decided to give it away to one of you. Yes, yes, you. Since I owe so much to you, the viewers, along with my readers at autotrader.com slash oversteer for letting me get this far in such a short time, I decided to give something back to all of you. Of course, the person who has helped most has been my editor at Oversteer, Doug DeMuro, but if I gave this car to him, he would probably want to crush it with his big yellow manhood extension. So he's out. That means I'm going to pick a random person to get this fantastic car. Now for the rules, and firstly, you have to be at least 18 with a valid driver's license. Obviously, you have to have a license to drive this thing. You also must have some money to pay taxes, tags, and to insure this car yourself. I realize there are a lot of people that are down on their luck and badly need a car, but this isn't necessarily who I want to see my Lincoln go to. Rather, I would prefer to enable someone to start making their own bad decisions, like me. Maybe I want someone to start their own hoopty fleet, or give them the ability to take a daily driver off the road to make some crazy modifications and use this as a daily driver. Mostly, I want to find someone who will take care of it preserve this car and possibly improve my gorgeous Lincoln. Now, this Lincoln is far from perfect. It does have some wear and a few dings from uh, use, but it's still a very interesting piece of Malays era history with plenty of life left in it. This is by far the most comfortable cruiser I have in my fleet, and it will be sad to see it go. Maybe giving away cars will turn into a theme for me and I'll become like a broke Oprah. Maybe not, but we'll see how this first one goes. Ah. If you want to be considered, it will require a bit of work on your part. You must upload a video to YouTube and email the link to Hoovy's Garage at yahoo.com. In two minutes or less, tell me about yourself and what your plans would be if you got my Lincoln. A link to my email is in the description box below, along with a link to my article on autotrader.com slash oversteer, where I talk more about my six months with the Lincoln. I will pick the top three submissions, share them on my channel, and let everyone vote for who's going to win. And for the love of God, if you're recording on your phone, flip it this way. As for the logistics of delivery, I haven't figured that out yet. I will only select someone living in the continental United States, and I might hand deliver it in person or have it shipped to your location. I would really enjoy driving it out somewhere fun and then catching a flight back, but I might not have time. I would also have to get my name off that no-fly list after an incident I had a few years ago. Ah! In addition to giving away the Lincoln, I will be selling my Ford Mustang Mach 1 and the Mighty Van because you all really didn't care to watch videos on either of them. And this will make room for some new arrivals and help pay off the massive money-sucking 911 LS swap project. So uh, that'll do it, I guess. Um, I really need to come up with a more catchy way to end these videos. Um, seek rest out. No, I didn't put any dents in it. These things have pretty thick metal. <laughs>